If you're not inside and the doors are all closed, then the people outside would probably hear you. Yes. Okay. So if we if we get control of the house and nothing goes wrong, I will come out the front door and I will whistle. Yeah, they would hear that. Okay. It's gonna be it's gonna be nighttime, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And mm-hmm. if a certain amount of time passes and I don't come out the front door and whistle, but how am I supposed to uh, tell it's you and not someone else? Don't, don't shoot. Why would why would somebody come outside and whistle if it wasn't me? Well, I'll be able to hear you whistle. Right. Yeah, you could he probably one of those one of those kind of whistles that are okay. really loud and piercing. Okay. I'm glad you did me. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to kill everybody. Kill okay. Us. So nightfall. nightfall. There's still been not not, a, not much movement from the house at all. There is some light coming out of, of the windows. It looks like uh lamp light or candle light. Um, you three have gone around to the back of the house and you're coming approaching the back door. So there's no windows on that side. Um, and you actually get all the way to the back door and nothing actually happens. Oh my god. Oh, you hear a dog fight happening inside. What the heck is going on? The big dog fighting, no. There are coyotes out here. Um, okay, so you guys managed to get to the back door without any incident. There's a lot, there's a lot of giant, really large pins. Um, and actually, here's what I do. Each of you guys can make me an intelligence check. But, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see if something else happens first. You guys managed to get to the back door. It's a simple door. There's no glass that <laughs> like the front door. Uh, it appears to be locked. I'm sorry? China woman. Emerald? Emerald. That oriental girl. That oriental girl knows that big lots. I know that. That's where he's going. I didn't have to say it. No, I didn't say it. Oh, you're taking out the character because I know that's what Jack was. The crafty character. Crafty character. So, what? Do you know how to get into places you shouldn't? Are you making assumptions of me as I walk to the door and start un? Picking the lock. Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> she pulls out. What does your lock pick like look like? Is it like a leather pouch and you pull it open and, you're, and there's like 12 lock picks? She yes. goes, yeah, okay. So she opens up this giant leather thing with all of these pieces of metal and she looks at the lock and she looks at the picks and she goes, no, no. As she's doing that, <laughs> as she's doing that, as a federal marshal, should I be concerned with what I'm seeing here right now? How about you just look the other way? <laughs> I have done that many a time on this journey. <laughs> <laughs> okay, make me a lock, uh, a lock pick, or a uh, locksmith, or whatever they say. I picked up a lock pick. Just. Uh, that's a 51, and I have a 45. You have 45, okay. You're not able to get it yet. It's going to take you a while. Oh, yeah, we can keep trying. How close was she? Oh, she's she was in six, close. 51 out of 46. Six, five. Can I give you three coins for that? And you, every, anybody can donate as they're all, they want they're all at any point. time. Yeah, okay. each, each one's yeah. one yeah. point. three coins? Yeah, no, anybody else oh, three I thought coins you were going to do it. So that's six, so that makes it. Yeah. Wait, click. That's what these are for. Oh, you gave one. Just because, like, isn't, like, old blocks, like, if she's, like, failing, it's actually a little loud, isn't it? I mean, like, honestly. There's scraping noises. If somebody's standing right next to the door, they might hear it. Yes, but, um... What it boils down to is, um, yeah, it could be if somebody's there. If there's a guard right by the door, they would, they would, they would hear it if she had to fiddle for a long time. <laughs> yeah, it's open. You can go in. I put my lockpicks back. Okay, guys. They work. Hidden away somewhere. Yep. Probably on the other guard or on the other side. Are you moving? Oh, my guard's close. Thank you. Are you saying all this? You just right. gesturing? Oh, very quietly. I okay. say that to him. Okay, Jack West got his gun. He's got his gun out. He's just pushing the door. It opens into the house. It's a little bit of weight. I'm not pulling it. It's going to be a push. Uh, yeah. You can see the hinges. Yeah. Uh, it's it's on it. Oh, good. Uh, it opens into a large box. It opens into a large room. The hinges don't make any creaking noises. There's a fireplace on your right. There's a huge pile of wood next to it. Uh, in the room there is there's a chair. 
there is an old man, there's an old woman, there's an old man, he's reading a book, looks like the Bible. Great. <laughs> there you go. Here, here's kind of a layout of the house so you have an idea. You guys run in the back door, which is towards the top of the page. You've seen this. They have not apparently noticed you yet. Do all three of us see that, or just him? Yes, actually, he's pushed the door open. How does that door open? It opens yeah. in, you said? That's okay. It is opens. This the back? Yeah, that's the back. It opens in, and he oh. peeks in. You're, he's the only one who can see them right now because you guys are seeing the kitchen area. Yeah. There's a giant wood stove. Uh, uh, you guys saw smoke coming out of the chimneys earlier. Uh, so, obviously, that, that's a thing. Um, actually, I'm going to retro something in. During the day, you see a little movement around the house because the old man was coming out to another wood pile and bringing wood in. Okay. So, um, it was an old man. It was something. No, you saw a man. You couldn't tell anything about him. He had his hat kind of pulled down. But you see, it's a little old man, obviously reading a, a thick book, probably a Bible. And a woman. Probably a Bible. She's knitting. Uh, in our later years, I. I'm glad we're together. Bye. Bye. You guys can hear voices. I told Whitney you can do the, the girl. You got three Yeah. Do the old lady. Oh, I'm not three Oh, I got it. Come on, you got to do it. I'm trying to do it. Oh, man. I'm going to have a little old man. It's a good time for us. It's a real good time. <laughs> I'll tell you what. It's a good time for us. Yeah, they're both black. These are white people. <laughs> So I don't She's knitting. He's reading a Bible. For your news, I have a shotgun. Because I, I didn't tell you before we did this, but I have a shotgun. I thought you had a Winchester. I have a Winchester and a shotgun. Oh, but it's a shotgun, though. Yeah, so I can, that's what I brought for this. Right, at least one of those guns had to be, like, with your horse. Like, you can't have a no, no, the Winchester's with the horse okay. now. Okay. Anyway. You hear voices. You can't make out the words. It's pretty damn clear. When you saw that, Jack West, what do you want to do? It's two old people. Uh, here we go. Oh, you can't check this. There's old people. Good God, they're old. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, they're Satanists. <laughs> Read the Bible. He's reading the Bible. Joe had it really hard. Oh, I'm always um, saying that. Should we just kill the federal marshals? No, I want to check the rest of the house. They seem to notice us. Definitely are, because I killed that roll. Oh, Um, you can see the whole downstairs is one big room. Maybe there's like a little pantry or something off to your left, and then there's some steps that there's the bottom side of steps, obviously going up to the upstairs. There are those open back steps that I hate. Instead of the trap on me in basement. Oh yeah. So you can tell there's steps going upstairs over the door that you're in. Yeah. And these two are just, she's knitting, her back is completely the door. He's kind of like at, at like this angle to you, probably at the back door. They're moving in is going to require stealth checks. Yeah. Or she's going to make noise. Because it's definitely a wooden floor. Couple rugs. I know you're whispering because you're in character, but what did you say? Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I was I saying that information too. Sure. Yeah. So I said I'm gonna watch for them. Y'all can go ahead. Or because it's too. Old. This is not a big house. It's like 15 feet deep from the door you there. Maybe 25 feet side to side. I know this tells me there's a second floor, but do I know where the stairs are? Yeah, because you guys can see. Yeah, you can see them. You can see them going up as you peek in the door. The door opens like okay. this. The steps go like this. Okay. Oh my god, that's spicy. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> you can tell there's steps going upstairs. Alright, I'm on my last. Look down here, I'm going to go upstairs. Stop it. Sorry. I'll count it Why? Very disgusting. Federal law on this. Why didn't we just knock on the door? Damn it. These people have not noticed you guys at all. Not with an 88, you fucking noticed. We're pretty good at getting shot at, so we try to be sneaky. <laughs> All right. I have a gun trained on each old person. <laughs> okay. You're seeing this. Oh He's like in the doorway, ready to blow these old people away. And once you peek in, you see them there. No, yeah, I, I stepped in a little bit. Where are they? Got to the side. There, there they are. Here they are. Mm-hmm. I wanted to get to the side a little bit so I could like. You guys have like that scene going through your mind, like, are we the like, baddies over here? <laughs> you want to be towards the pantry door? There's a pantry door. 
That'd be the easiest way to kind of step in and put your back to the wall, like right there in that corner. Mm-hmm. Okay. You can be like that and be like. Someone should check out. I'm going upstairs with these people. Okay. I need stealth check. Doesn't he have to go past them? Pretty much. They're facing the fire. Oh, shit. Yeah. Fire in the fireplace. Mm-hmm. Come on, Kyle. It's a tiny house. Look. Here's Grandma. Here's Grandpa. He's facing here. She's facing like that. They're both kind of looking towards the fire. So you have to go up the steps. <laughs> See what I'm saying? <laughs> what if I walked slower than anyone possibly ever could? I need to be Batista from... <laughs> There's still a yeah, chance that he will notice you because of his angle. Because his angle is... Okay, if this is the house, mm-hmm. this area that we're in, that's the door. Where James Brown is sitting is where the door you're coming in. It's a little small. It's a little bigger than what I'm saying. But he's kind of facing like this. So there's no way you can move... To the steps and reading? up without him noticing yeah, out of his peripheral. That, but his peripheral, he he's going to see, he's going to see, he could, okay, he <laughs> could see movement. You can try, and if you make a stealth, that means you're like hugging the shadows, moving very, very, yeah. very slowly, blah, blah. If you fail the stealth, he does get it. I'm just going to give him a spot hidden check. Okay. To see if he's like, there's a fan <laughs> over there. <laughs> I guess my question was, is that like, this little path takes what, maybe 30 seconds to do? Mm-hmm. What if I tried to drag it out for 30 minutes? Not even a stealth check. That's literally just like, how in God's name? That will require a con check. <laughs> yeah. So see if you can handle all this. The... <laughs> and then they have a con check, so you have to pee during that time. <laughs> or something. Yeah, they're gonna have to be. Anything is gonna, it's gonna require you a check to get this close to somebody. (laughs) Unless you were like Master Thief. (laughs) If you were Master Thief and had jacked your stealth up to 90 or 100 or 150 percent, yeah, you might be able to be like Ninja in. Before I do this, (laughs) I'm going to relay the information that I am not very good at sneaking. And I do not want us to shoot old people. Yeah, you guys, I'm gonna allow you guys to be like quietly whispering as much as you want. Check first. Uh, uh, do you want to, or do you want me to go? I still think it's rude to walk into an old, pe- old people's old house. People's house. Yeah, it's it's not an old people's home. We'll <laughs> <laughs> just knock on the door. My house. <laughs> I don't encourage it. <laughs> I like it. I like the way he plays the game. It's, it's the worst. No. <laughs> I love you. I love you, you, know, you, know, know, I love you. Uh oh. You might have another. Oh, God. <laughs> Because these old people, I'll sneak up they might shoot us. I tell them, um, what if you go way down by the window? By the window? Yeah, on the second floor. Oh. So you point up, you go way by the window. And you guys all know there's a window up there. Yeah. On uh, essentially, so you're coming in this door, on essentially this wall, um, the south wall. You can look at the map. So you, you want to come outside? Yeah. And you can see that there's some kind of a... When you peek up, you can see it's some kind of a... God, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, Anything loft? Loft. That's totally what I'm trying to say. Okay, but before she goes... She can find it. Uh Uh-huh. Okay. He hands you off this thing. I take it and put it under my dress. Okay. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. I put it under my. I put the rod in my dress. Oh, okay. Where? And it does move on its own. <laughs> oh, stop! No, it's not your <laughs> you just drove the. <laughs> Remember that pen driving game we played? Oh yeah. my god! That oh. one woman that came. Who oh, had, uh, later I was like, you never came back. She's like, oh, it was all. Dick jokes and testosterone at the table, and I was like, I'm sorry. You literally I said that I was the first one to make a sex joke. <laughs> I'm just saying, it made yes. her uncomfortable. Let's not go. Oh, you're right. No. No, 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 her, that girl. Oh, the, 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 the young woman who came I don't remember that, but that was when we had James, too, and that was. We had a, Bo was playing, a lot of people were playing, who were. Mm. Anyway, so you, you've got the rod, it's tucked away, and you're going to try to sneak upstairs. Yeah. Give me a stealth check. Talk about when I played Bud Fanning? Yeah. Yes. He had the Lord Bud Fanning. Three. Two. Oh, three out of what? Out of 50. 50? Okay, so. Half is a hard success. So it'd be 25%. One fifth out of 50 would be 5%. Yeah. No, 10%. Yes. One fifth. That's an extreme success. And you rolled an 03? I rolled an 03. Anybody want to give her two coins? An 01 is a critical success. 
Ooh, yeah. Oh, I'm out of too. orange. You got you? got more than me. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> I was just seeing how many I can get. of coins? No, I, I never said that. Jack West needs his coins to survive. Oh, I do sometimes. Success. Okay, so, um, whoosh. Yeah. Uh, you guys pretty much walk her. Here's what you guys see. She just walks in the room, walks up the steps, just whoop, 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 and she's gone. And you're like, maybe that's how it is without stirrups. <laughs> <laughs> and that's Jack West's thought. Uh, yeah. In your, to you, it's super quiet. But you know the shadows. Give that to Jack West. Yay, I got a coin bag. Because um, that was in character. I get points. You should Okay, point. you're upstairs. You get There's a bed up there. It's a double bed, obviously, for two people. There's a bookcase. Uh, not a bookcase. Uh, wardrobe. There. There's a table. The drawers are in the hold this over. No, there's no wardrobe. No. Chest of drawers. Chest of drawers. A small table and a chair. Uh, like a writing desk. I'll go straight over to the window. Okay, uh, you go to the windows. It looks outside. <laughs> And yeah, there's no light up here. Yeah, it, oh yeah. Slide up kind of windows, very easy. There's two of them side by side that you can slide one or the other or both. And then there's like a piece of wood in between the two. Yeah. Excuse me, but you can. Um, no, they're open. Um, it's hot as hell. It's always been freaking California. So both windows are wide open. There's no lights up here, but you do see a lantern, uh, or a lamp, actually a glass lamp, uh, sitting on a side table next to the bed. Uh, the bed's actually under the window. Against the wall that the woman's in. Um, uh, there's a nice breeze coming. Uh, it's very pleasant. You see the flicker of candlelight and firelight coming from downstairs, but it's uh, and there's nothing that you can kind of see around you, and nothing looks out of place or anything like that. And the windows are wide open, so you can easily just whoop, right out. Mm -hmm. um, um, on their bed, bed sheet. Yeah, bed sheet, quilt. Uh, well, it's a quilt. All you can see is the quilt. Because mm -hmm. uh, that's over everything else. A couple of uh, down pillars. I'd like to uh, just kind of remember where those blankets were and then take the quilt off and stick it out the window for them. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, you can tie one end of the quilt to the uh, end of the, the bed. You're probably going to need to tie something else to it to get all the lighting around. You know what I mean? They're tall. Oh, okay. right. yeah. This will this will come out three or four feet. From the, the top of the bed and tie it off. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, set up. I'll go down, you set up for you. Uh, yeah, you see her peek out the window? Okay. Uh, Can I reach? Feel like, kind of like this. It flops down. You can't reach it. It's maybe two feet above your arm. I do that. I just yep. like, jump, jump. <laughs> jump two feet in the air. <laughs> I don't know what you can do. <laughs> The way you said there's two. Okay. He tries to jump. You want to jump? Make a jump chain. If you make it, I will give you grabbing it with such a grip that you can actually hang on and pull yourself up without with minimal noise. If you fail it, we'll figure that. Made it. Did you really? I actually did the. I was gonna do the James Williams thing where I was like, it made it. We had a play in a group would be like this. That's a hit. No, no, it was more like this. That's a hit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, no, it was like uh, nice thing. Anyway, so <laughs> yeah, you know the twenty. Put a check by that jump. There's twenty on. Here's what he does. Well. He he crouches down. No, remember I said I don't know what I can do. That's what I mean. And so you were like, yeah. no, I said that out loud. And he, I don't know what I can do. And he's hanging there, and he's like, <laughs> un unseen by her due to the darkness, is the surprised look on your face. Oh, okay. <laughs> Man, I got some. You can pull yourself up, pal. Um, I'm just gonna say you're not holds, whatever. Oops, I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Start playing basketball after this. <laughs> uh, that's what's up. I don't think well, it's around. It is around 1875. It's not popular yet. I'm pretty certain that at least Catholic schools were playing it, and some other people with the boys from Cape Farm. I don't know. Because it was created out of YMCA. What is going on? Okay. What's he doing? Oh, he was eating his shoe. My you ever flip flops? Those are you nice. No. Not mine. It's your own fault, James Brown. Nice flip flops, flip flop guy. Okay, Kyle, uh, Kyle, you're up. It takes you. I mean, it's a hard climb. You know what I mean? Because it's yes. straight up a like, dead climb with your with your arms. Yes, right. Um, but I'll give it to you. It, it takes you a couple minutes to get up and kind of get into the window as quietly as you possibly can. So the two of you are now upstairs. Um, While he does that, can I use the dowsing rod? Or the oh yeah. Rod. Um. 
down? Almost well, well, straight down. <laughs> Slightly at an angle towards the fireplace, but mostly down. Which is it the old? We don't know. I'm assuming you're standing kind of in the middle of this area when you do it. Yes. So yeah, mostly down and kind of in this direction towards the fireplace. Okay. That. So weird. Yeah. Okay. Um, a moment later, he gets up. Okay. She shows you where it's pointing. She's like, <laughs> Well, let's look up here first, though. Even if it is down there, I'm just going to search the room. Um, chest of drawers, Sorry. bed. And, uh, well, there's chest of the basement bed. That makes sense. And, like, a writing desk. Okay. Um, I'm going to start with the chest. Just assume, assume there's a guy super in the slow again. Yeah. I don't know what creeps or what does. I know. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll give you, if you guys take your time on this, oh, take my boots off. Taken, Oh, there we okay, go. that's a great idea. Um, I'm assuming, what kind of shoes are you? <laughs> oh, <laughs> I thought you meant my house. I'm like, oh, would one of the dogs yeah. go? I'm sorry. Um, okay, he pulls his boots off, and he's creeping around the stairs very slowly. Um, writing desk has a few writing utensils and blank pages of pieces of paper, but nothing. <laughs> <laughs> chest of drawers closed. Uh, the big chest at the base. Um, oh, oh. Are, are, did you want to look around too? Uh, yes. Okay. I'll give you each a spot hidden. Who is spot hidden? Yes. Yes? Uh, 30 and I have 40. Okay, two yeses. Alright. These poor old people, they're just poor old people. We're searching their house. What is the shotgun doing underneath all the stuff in the chest? Oh, uh, wow. Look, there's, uh, there's another rifle underneath the chest of drawers. That's weird. Hey, there's a revolver in the writing desk. It's a little uh, six shooter. That's a lot of guns. This is why we didn't just walk. <laughs> nah. There's a lot of guns, and they're all like tucked away and hidden in little places around. Can there. I do like a knowledge check, or can I? Well, I guess I just do it in character. You can do anything. You want. There's other people in this house. Seems like it. Should we just drop enough windows to whatever this space was? Well, he's the space is main face. <laughs> he's still watching the old people. I don't think I can get his attention without getting their attention. No, he's he's under. He's <laughs> toss the shotgun out. It goes off. The alarm <laughs> is actually sticks out over where the doors are. And you know he's back over here in the corner in the darkness. Why don't we just do this? And I start taking all the ammo out of every gun and leaving the guns where they're at. That will make noise. Opening guns up. Oh, Opening yeah, guns up. Makes, shot yeah, it makes clicking. Glide. Glide. And I'm telling you this before you do any of it. Uh, yeah, especially the rifle, the Winchester. Um, that kind oh. of stuff. It'll make, because you're going to have to sh- 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 yeah. sh- work the action every time you pull every bullet out. Uh, for the Winchester. And <gasps> open up this. Click, click. It, it, it feels right now like it's really quiet in here. You can hear the crackling of the front. I'm going to go ahead and it's say it crackling. anyways, because you're not going to think of it. So he's not going to do it. Well... You realize this before you start to break open guns and, and empty them of ammo that it will make some noise and they might hear you. Right. It doesn't mean you they will, but they're going to get the rolls, not you guys. Lower them out the window. Drop them out the window. Yeah, you can just... You remember that the two of us are outside. Would, would too, that be so louder like, than the No. It would not be louder to break the guns open and empty them as to, like, throw them out on the grass. Okay. All right, throw them that would the actually grass. be a lot I'd like to keep the revolver with me. Yeah, you can. It's just a, it's a peacemaker. Just a, got a good man. Yeah, that's nice here. <laughs> okay. Oh, nice. You can chuck the shotgun and you can chuck the Winchester out the window. Yeah. Since we found those guns, am I certain that's all the guns in this room? Uh, you guys can do uh, another search. Take your time. Um, uh, under the mattress in the bed, there is another. There's a Henry rifle. Uh, under one of the pillows, there is another pistol. Jesus. Uh, <laughs> you find in a pants of underwear, there's a Derringer. There's a lot of guns up here. Little tiny pocket Derringer with two shots, 244. Nice little gun. Oh my God. There's a lot of guns in this place. Yeah, we get rid of all Derringer. of them. Every okay, gun. you tuck the Derringer. And you're gonna, um, that's all you find upstairs. That's a lot of guns for this little loft. You're wondering what the hell's downstairs in the cupboards and the cabinets, maybe under the cushions and the chairs they're sitting in. That they don't have food here. <laughs> uh, you chucked the two all they need to eat. The uh, Henry rifle out the window. Yeah. Well, she grabbed, she took the Derringer. And she, you see her kind of like tuck it away. Um, and she's got the pistol in her hand still. Yes. And then, um, let's see, there's Henry and, uh, oh, and another six shooter. You toss out the Yeah. That's a lot of guns for this house. That's weird. 
As far as you know, all the guns are gone here. Except for the ones in your hands. Uh, they're outside. No, they're outside and it's is dark. Is it lit? Is it lit on the... It's lit, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> upstairs, is, there's no light upstairs. All you get is the wash oh, downstairs. Okay. So he probably does not... He might see... Really I'm at the front of the house. Movement, <laughs> but you can't... What the hell? Is that bats? You know, all he's seen is like movement maybe in the air. And I'm not even going to say probably he sees that. Okay. I guess right. I'm going to go out the way I came up. Okay, you can. Because mm-hmm. I can't... Yeah, downstairs you can you climb can. down, let yourself to the end, and just there you go. There's a bunch of guns on the ground. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you don't land on one. No, no, no. I'm assuming you get a little, a little chuck <laughs> away from the ground. You're still upstairs. You're down outside. You're still hiding and watching Grandma and Grandpa, yeah. who are talking about Job and uh, 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 the Zachary. Book of Job, and yeah, they're talking biblical stuff. He's a boy. I always admire them. Those Bible. Okay. Yes. Because he's got to climb out. You, you, as you're climbing out the window, we'll retro in. She's saying something to you. Um, tell Jack, or what's his face, to uh, <laughs> stay up here and train a gun on him because I don't trust him. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, and down you go. Um, so you want to go to the pitch, just the balcony? Yeah, it's the like balcony. Bars. And just see if I can yeah, you can name it. Which one? Well, you have a danger and you have a pistol. If you want to name it both of them, you can name it both of them. Um, you said yes. it was pointing at the fireplace, right? No, the people. No, the, the, the rod is pointing at the fireplace. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the rod is. In that direction. Did you tell them More that? down. Yes, yes. yes. She's been going. Are they facing the fireplace? Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay. As you would. Like you do. Thank you. That's the only room upstairs as well, right? Yes, it's just a loft. You can see across. You could actually, if you walk to the edge of the loft, you can see down into the rest okay. of the house. So looking out. That's what you're doing. Yes. You've got a peacemaker and a pistol. Yeah. Or a derringer. Yeah. Or do you want both in? What's, what do you want to do? Just tell me what, how you want to look. I have two peacemakers. Because I have the one that I had. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got two peacemakers. Okay. So one of either one, just on the railing up there, just waiting. They got their backs to you. Okay. How you have come to the ground? Good. What do you want to do? Back in with Jeff was. Okay. Um, I will give you two guys a spot hidden each to see if you see him come out of the house. If you notice no. him. No, no, no. no. Right oh, no, no, no. That's right. That's the They're around the front. They might yeah. notice him pop out the window. You didn't know you made back for some reason. Yeah. Did you? Nice. Okay. If it's not checked off, check it off. Um, you do see somebody come out of the window upstairs. Here was it? Oh, now, Haley, here's the thing. You didn't, ooh, you didn't see him going, but you do see somebody come out the window upstairs, like scuttle down the side of the building almost, oh, and then drop to the ground, and then scoot around towards the back of the house. All right, I'm going to alert you since you're the one with okay. the gun, because that's definitely what I do. I'd be like, hey. You don't see anybody. Whoever it is, it's gone, because he wasn't there for long. But remember, you don't know who that was or what's going on. Keep that in mind. I know it's hard to separate in-game and out-of-game knowledge sometimes, so... Okay, so that's what you saw. Somebody. So that back to the house. If, if, is that like how she it. describes it? Like, almost like animals. Yeah, that's exactly it's how it's like a something animalist. came out of the house. Things what the hell? I get a really serious... You guys are freaking Remember, out with all your supernatural They're You're a hundred yards away. <laughs> and yes, it's pretty dark night. Um, hey, let's see what the weather does. <gasps> Thunder. It's, and, and then, now you're getting wet. Some rain starts to come down. It's not too bad in the, in, in the <laughs> trees. Uh, the rain starts just as you reach the back door again. I feel like I have a very, it's not very hard. It's just hey, so serious nice. expression on that, that I think it's something I, unnatural. Okay. <laughs> what do you want to do? Kyle? Hey, she's upstairs. Oh, the guns are going to be You don't have to do that anymore. <laughs> Oh, he, wait, he can't see her, right? Because she's basically... No, she's where basically we are above us, yeah. right. You'd have to actually go further into the room Let's to be able to... She... Oh, shit. She still got the rod. Oh! oh. oh. I'm, not, I'm not climbing back up, but I'm not doing that. But, uh, she said it was pointing down into the, the fireplace. And the entrance. That's what I'm thinking. So let's look. They're facing the fireplace. <laughs> okay, I'll knock out the old woman. Shut the man. No, don't do that. I never. <laughs> no, I'm thinking there might be a basement somehow, like a trap door. It's usually the kitchen, which is right here. We don't have to hurt old people. Yeah, kitchen is right there. Yeah. 
We don't have to hurt old people. I'm going to stress that one more time. We can check that. I'm going to holster one of my guns. Okay. There's a door behind you with the wall. It's probably some kind of pantry or something. And then there's the kitchen area, which is open to the rest of this room. Are you going... What's the plan? Let's open the door. <laughs> I'll right. check it for a trap door. Okay. Uh, open the door. It's very quiet. And you creep in. And Well, you bo- are you both going in? I'm going in, at least. Okay. You were checking the trap. You both go in and start looking, feeling around. It's pretty dark in there, except for, like, spillover light. <laughs> oh, my God. And um, you don't... The, the floor seems solid. Yeah, it does. Mm-hmm. Now, is there any other doors? Yeah. No, no. Um, it, this is the pantry. The kitchen's an open area. It's one big room, basically. Is there a wall or room beyond the fireplace? Mm-hmm. Due no. To what we saw on the outside. Okay. No, no, no. That's the fireplace on the outside of the building. It's going to be under the fireplace. And I've felt every floor of the, of the kitchen. Like, mm-hmm. nothing. The only thing I've done is, like, knock, knock, knock. Checking, because that will make noise. But you're looking for something to pull up. Or something that will, some kind of a trap door, like a, a ring or something, anything. It feels all very solid. You don't, yeah, you don't find, you don't find any like, like, you know, um, creases or like cuts that would indicate a trap door without a ring. You know what I mean? It's they're solid boards. Do I try to have a casual conversation with them, or just not enough? a casual conversation with people that don't think? Anyone else is in the house? <laughs> yes. Not yet. Have you done that? Before? You got your guys <laughs> trained on them. Yeah, if they, if they do make it weird. Oh, also. Oh, yeah. like, we found like seven guns. Yeah, like, or or if no, they, I don't blame you. Like, so, like, if they try to get up, not go the one. The old so lady's right knitting. Right now. That five might be a good one. Um, oh, do me a luck check. Let's do you <laughs> for a luck check real quick. Let's see, let's see what happens. Beth, what are you doing? Uh, 29, and I have a 75. Right. They're just, they're hanging out. We're staying up awful late tonight. Well, I gotta finish about Joe. We we have to figure out what happens to him. Yes, sir. God works in mysterious I'll ways. Well, I'm not so mysterious for a woman. Anywhere. She's You're right, of course. I love her. I love you, too. <laughs> If you hear this conversation, some kind of conversation is going on outside. Uh, I think we're walking up You're to the old people. Okay. Not even trying to sneak anymore, just walk up. Yeah, yeah well, we're not good at sneaking. So. I don't, I don't. I'm assuming you put your boots back on just before you went back out there. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. He did, and I just tossed them over. No, I would assume that he would be like, he would have grabbed his boots, he would have got to the window, and then he would have put them on, then climbed up. I'm going to give him that. Uh, I think no one was less of a threat, so I'm going to take her. Okay? <laughs> but the shooter, that's your call. I'm, I'm telling you, I think there's a gun in the Bible, though. Like, just watch him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he turns around too fast. His hands are gone. <laughs> Once again, I want to stress that we don't have to hurt old people. I'm a federal marshal. I feel like people forget this. <laughs> oh, this is a bad word. All right, it was your words of hell. All right. Well, you lead the way. I'm sneaking back out. Here's our Wells Fargo. Thanks. Just so, in case you wanted to see him in the distance. Okay. So you guys are. Uh, give me stealth checks. Okay. Well, this is just to see if they hear you. Yeah, if we don't come at them with guns drawn to their faces. Holy shit! You made it? Yeah. Hell no. Okay. Ninety-nine. Okay. Uh, so I'm like, I'm like, I think I'm gonna figure out this sneaking thing. Just <laughs> put it with a check to a cop. Yeah, you walk up quietly, and here comes Jack West. Chink, 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 chink. Those damn spurs. They turn towards Jack West. So she's actually tur- okay. So you guys are coming this way. And actually, in this, this order, the old lady turns like this towards him. The old man turns like this towards him. Uh, the old man drops the Bible. He's like, Mosey! Um, the old lady's like, Ugh! And she drops her knitting, terrified. They both are looking at him because they haven't noticed you yet. Uh, and you notice this, too. They both look at Jack, who seems really loud when he walks him. Boom, 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 boom. Um, oh, oh, no! Oh, dear! It's robbers! They're going to kill us! He's going to... No, not me. He's going to kill us! He's going to kill us. That's the old man. The old woman's like, well, I knew I could only live so long. As long as you keep your gun, hands up. <laughs> the old woman shoves her arms up as high as they'll go. Now, the old man still got his up here. Oh, just take whatever you want. Real just quick. take it. We're just cattle farmers. We're just trying to make a living. Well, you're a black Don't kill me. my Kill me first. Well, you Don't shut up. <laughs> 
<laughs> so shut up. <laughs> if I can take whatever I want, I would like the crescent. 